Now, 28 years in the business, and I do pre-call planning all the time. I think when we do coaching, we need to do pre-call plans. And the new Sales Leader Growth Series does a fabulous job of giving you some of those if you haven't seen it. But bottom line is, I start out, every, every time I do a, a sales call or a coaching call, how may I serve? And I ask, how may I serve? Because that changes, if you're familiar with the transactional analysis model, that gets me out of critical parent, puts me in nurturing parent, puts me in adult, takes me out of child. How may I serve? It changes my energy, and I meet people where they are. So we have to value our prospect, we have to pre-call plan, and we have to value our offer, because if we don't value it, why would they? So we have to have conviction. People buy our conviction. It's the energy we give off. It's our belief, right? But what gets in the way? Those inhibitor thoughts, right? What kind of garbage goes in there? And so this is a model. This is the Sandler uh, new coaching model. And I think it's something we want to use. So obviously, we want to do a pre-call plan, right? But I think we want to do a pre-beliefing plan, a pre-belief form. And I think we need to ask our team, what are the top three beliefs you have going in on this call, right? Sales happen in one two hundredths of a second. What beliefs are we taking in on that call? What beliefs are we taking in on that coaching meeting we're having? Are they accelerators or are they inhibitors? Let's get it out of the subconscious and let's do it by design, not by default. I think we have to value ourselves when we go in to sell and coach. How many people remember Nancy and the Seagull story, right? Nancy was a little girl in California, and she drew this beautiful picture, a house and the sun, and the art teacher came over and said, oh, it's beautiful, Nancy, but we gotta, put, we gotta balance it, and they put a seagull in there. She goes nuts. Only in California, it ends up in court, right? And it's, it, it takes a day of deliberation, they're not getting anywhere, and finally the judge says, Nancy, Nancy, why were you so upset? And she said, I didn't see it there. We think, how many of us think, hey, I'll believe that when I see it? Reality is, it's the opposite. We can't believe anything. We can't see anything until we believe it. And so we've got to change that, that process. We're not going to believe it. We're not going to see it until we have that belief. Belief trumps seeing it. And so she said, I didn't see it there. If we don't see it there, we'll never be able to release it. And so journaling. David Sandler, you had to have a journal in his inbox. Now, his inbox in those days was actually a paper box, okay? But the inbox was, you had to have your journal in there. I am, remember, the mind believes whatever we tell it. And so when we say, I am, it begins to believe it and interpret it as a command. So how do we replace some of those inhibitor thoughts, some of those thistle seeds? It begins with, I am. It begins with journaling, right? It begins with programming the mind. How many of us got up today, looked at our iPhone, and the first thing it said was, you have 10 updates? How many of us are updating here? Right? This is a pretty old model to update. So we use the power of I am. We use the power. I would not be here today if I didn't journal to change those beliefs. I journaled, true confession, two years ago to be here today. I am a summit presenter. It starts with I am. That's how we change the thoughts. Our thoughts are our true creators. Remember, we don't argue with our own data. How about we put better data in? Belief happens in one two hundredths of a second. And so, what do we have to let go of? You know, our journaling is the mechanism that connects our subconscious with the conscious. It reaches down there and pulls it out. Letting go is hard to do, but what are those thoughts that we need to let go of and help our team let go of? Thank you for watching this highlight video from the Sandler Summit. 
You can join us for the next Sandler Summit in 2024, March 19th and 20th at the Orlando World Center Marriott. Register now at sandler.com summit.